Hi guys, Craftbench here, and here's a testing video of the new stone wood sandstone and the old cobble uh, smooth stone slabs, as they're called now. So, first of all, I'm going to show you how to make them all, and then we're going to do some testing on how they work and stuff. So, let's open up here. To make, let's go from right to left. So, to make cobblestone slabs, you're going to want to take some cobblestone and go one, two, three. And it'll give you a stack of three stone slabs. Well, I'm just going to take six stone slabs. Okay, now to make wooden slabs, you're going to take some wooden planks, which you get from tree trunks, and we're going to make six of them as well. Wooden slab, stone slab, and to make sandstone, ones like this, you first need to make some sandstone, which is four of those. This is probably the most resource uh, intensive one out of them all because you use so much sandstone. Sandstone takes quite a bit of time to make. And there we have three of them. Just going to take a few more out of here. To make clean stone slabs, like the ones on the end there, we go get some clean stone and go like that. And a stone slab. So now we have all the ones we need, and we're just going to see how they work. So when you place them down, they take up half a step. So you can walk up smoothly without having to jump. As you can see there, I can't just walk smoothly up there, I can walk smoothly up here. Put one down, walk smoothly up. That can be used to implement in stairs, so you can walk up and down stairs reasonably quickly. The only disadvantage is that you've got to have your slab here, then you've got to leave one and then have the next one. You can use, the when they are stacked on top of each other, they become a standard cobblestone block. As you can see, the outline for this one only goes around halfway. Outlines are there. But for this one, there is no halfway outline, like two outlines, it's just one block. But when you break it, you get given two slabs back. Uh, previously with these slabs, you would have only got one back, but they have patched that so that you now get two back, which is good. Same with these wooden ones. So we just finish putting these wooden ones down, and that just goes into a standard like wooden block, but comes into two slabs. Let's test out the smooth stone. They all basically do the same function, but they just look different. So you can just imagine there's another one on there, and it just turns into one. So if I take this block here, it actually completely changed because you'd think there'd be like that would be there, and then it just have another one on top of it. But that isn't what happens. It completely changes. And it looks like just a standard sandstone block, but comes back into two of these. Here's some. I think it's called stone slab. And unlike all the other ones, this is actually two slabs just stacked on top of each other. And then you destroy it. You get your two back, just like all the other times. A few interesting facts is that all of them, no matter what they're made out of, need to be mined with a pickaxe. See how quickly that went? Whereas you might think that the wooden ones want an axe. You can see that it's taking a long time, whereas same with a shovel and same with an axe, whereas with a pickaxe, it just rips up straight away. And that's mainly it. A few more bits of trivia about these slabs is that previously, before this update, uh, these stone slabs were made with cobblestone, and you would have just gone like that, and it would have given you that smooth slab but now it doesn't. So you have to bake uh, cobblestone into smooth stone for it to make these ones now. So guys, I hope hope this uh, tutorial and testing video on the new half steps helped and I hope to see you in the next one guys. Please like the video, comment what you thought and any questions you have and don't forget to subscribe. See ya. I can hear a pig, can you?
Where's this pig coming from? He's enslavement. He's been a naughty pig. Naughty pig. 